This question. Sabella so Toratu is saying, how do you handle having strong ideological differences with your friends and family? Example, if they are super woke or super religious. My brother is super woke and I love him, but I struggle to talk to him sometimes. Um, I think it depends on you making the consideration and deciding within yourself what extent do you want to actually center this difference that you have in your relationship. Like sometimes the differences just come out in your discussion and it can't be avoided, but some people actually go out of their way to talk about their differences or like bring that into a conversation constantly. So you kind of have to be like, how much do I want to just kind of like, you know, let it roll off my back and not address it too much. But if you decide that this is something you want to actually address or you value engaging with your family members about these issues, one thing I find really helpful is street epistemology. So Google street epistemology. Um, and um, basically if someone is in the right mindset, um, you can say it helps to preface it with being like, is it okay if I like just kind of question how you established some of these things and just ask them questions about how they came to their conclusions on the basis of what evidence. And I find that that's a really good and interesting way to have a back and forth about um, how people came to establish the beliefs that they have confidence in. It might, it might also be a good, it might be okay. I don't know your situation. It might also be a good idea not to have a back and forth with your brother and leaving that kind of discussion to outside of your family and just being a brother to your brother. And, you know, because, you know, like you don't have to convince everybody, like right? you don't, you, you might want to, it might be a good idea for you not to make your home that kind of an environment you know again unless 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 your family is like a very like for example in my uh, with my, me and my father and my brothers like we love fighting with each other over like political or uh, or ideological stuff it's just it's our way of having fun right but for a lot of people that's not a good environment to have at your home and you know you could like if you are interested in convincing other people out of their ideas you might want to do that not in your own not where you sleep and eat <laughs> if, if that is like if that stresses you out um and you you might want to like not not make the environment you live in or the people you hang out with a hostile environment right you could just be like you know you're Unless again, un it really depends. Unless that's your idea of having fun, and he he likes having discussions with you, and you like it as well, and this being, makes creates a bond and brings you even closer together because you're having disagreements with each other and debating with each other. Unless that, if you feel like this is actually create tension, then with your family members and your friends and your um, significant other, then your main goal should be to maintain. A healthy loving relationship more than doing activism on them right um again i'm not saying that don't change people's opinions just do it somewhere more somewhere that is not going to affect your own mental health or well-being or calmness you, you in fact in fact you would be a more effective activist if you have some sense of security and stability and calmness in your environment so for the sake of being able to be more productive and changing other people's opinions don't don't shit where you eat basically so poetic <laughs> 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 hey guys if you're a fan of blasphemy and sexy cali you know like me then you need to be sure to subscribe to our newsletter link in the description below because if you subscribe, we will send you a free copy of our Blasphemous Art ebook. And let me tell you, it is the tastiest blasphemy that you can find anywhere available today. And we are so generous with our blasphemy that we continue to send you more blasphemy every week. So make sure to subscribe. Link in the description below.